I'm Diana, you're watching Physics Girl. Welcome to part two of Riddles with Anne Wojcicki. If you missed the first part, there's a link in the description, or you can jump to the end of this video at the end credits. There's a direct link. Here's a recap of the first riddle, and it's gonna go straight into the answer. So you've been warned. There's an adventurer, uh, okay. an explorer somewhere on the globe. Uh -huh. This adventurer, she walks um, a mile south, and then she walks a mile east. A mile? And then a mile north. Okay, mile south, a mile east, and then a mile north. And she ends up in the exact same place. Where oh. on earth is she? So she's at the North Pole. She's walking south, and she goes east, and then she goes north. Beautiful. But there's another answer. Oh. Yeah. OK. What can you think okay, of what the other one? answer is? Yeah. I, I feel like there's only one point. I mean, depends on how far south you go. Well, I guess if you have to start. Do I get a? Do you want a hint? Yeah. OK. <laughs> I'm gonna turn it like this. Can see a bit of a hint. So, okay. what happens as you get closer and closer and closer and closer yeah, to no, here as you're going together. east? Yeah. Well, what if you, at the end of your eastern trip, ended up in the same place? But that would have to be at the South Pole. Not necessarily. Why not? Because you're going a mile. Oh, oh, the mile. Mm -hmm. I forgot about that detail. When like, oh, when the circle, when I go around, when the, oh. Yes. When the circumference is a mile. Exactly. If you start on the globe a mile north of any point where going east a mile will take you in a full circle, you'll end up back in the same spot when you walk back north. Oh, I love that. Yeah. yeah. I almost want to hug you. <laughs> oh, that's so <laughs> good. Oh, I mean, I love that. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, and then you're going a mile on the circle. Yeah. That's awesome. There's more places. Oh my goodness. To so move on yeah. to the next riddle, because I really yeah. want to ask you the real one. Yeah. I'm just going to tell you the I'm, answer. This is the warm up. This is the warm up. <laughs> well, this part was tricky. This part was like, mm -hmm. that was the warm up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You got that really fast. Okay. So. Good. so if you start somewhere north of a place where during your Eastern trip, mm -hmm. you can go around a number of times and get back to the same spot, that's also Oh, so you an can answer. go east a number of times. Yeah. So if you go east and the circumference is half a mile, then you can go around. If it's right. like an integer right. multiple right. So of a fraction. Totally makes you can start doing all the different loops around. Exactly. Got so it. there's like almost an infinite, infinite number, number of places totally. toward the south pole. I totally, pole. totally get it. That's yeah. awesome. Yeah, you can go, you around can just go around times. multiple times. Yeah, that's awesome. Next riddle. Okay. And Ready. next and, and last riddle. Okay, oh. so it involves this prop right here. Okay. So um, if there's a spool, mm -hmm. um, you can feel it if you want. The question is, mm -hmm. the riddle is, I'm gonna lay it down on the ground so that the, the rope is mm -hmm. coming from underneath the spool mm -hmm. and I'm gonna pull it mm -hmm. this way. Okay. Um, and this doesn't rotate, it's it's like it's fixed. stuck on okay. here, it's fixed. When I lie this on the ground mm -hmm. and I pull this directly sideways, mm -hmm. which way is this gonna roll? Imagine a setup where there's enough friction so that the spool will only ever roll, it won't slide. Now, when the spool is pulled to the left and the rope is kept parallel to the ground, will the spool roll to the left and wind up? Roll to the right and unwind or not move. We interrupt your regularly scheduled programming for this important message. Nah, just because I like making you suffer because you're gonna have to come back tomorrow to get the answer to the second riddle. In the meantime, discuss in the comments or suggest a victim you'd like to see on here answering riddles. Okay, bye. Ah, uh, happy physicsing.